Today we're in 2 Timothy chapter 3. But understand this, that in the last days there will come times of difficulty. So he's saying in the last days, the times that are leading up to Jesus' return, it is saying that there will come times of difficulties. These are some of the signs. For people will be lovers of themselves. We see that all the time. People are lovers of themselves. What can I do for myself? It says, lovers of money. That is 100% all over in America. How much money do you have? What can I buy next? What can I do with my money? They'll be proud and arrogant. That is 100% America again. We're proud and arrogant. Abusive. Disobedient to their parents. We see that all the time. People have no respect to their parents. They um, don't care about their parents. They're, and then it says here, next is ungrateful. We are very ungrateful for what we have in America. We are very disobedient with our what we have. And then it says next um, thing is unholy. We are unholy. We are is a we look. As if we're Christian nation, but we're not a Christian nation. We have very few actual Christians in the U.S. that are actually biblical Christians that are true to what the text says of how we're supposed to act and how we're supposed to be. I mean, we're still all sinful, but we need to be true to what Scripture says and not true to um, rituals. Because that is man's doctrine. That is false. And what the next verse says is, we are heartless, unpleasable, slanderous, without self-control. I mean, it is 100% describing the state that we're in America. And I'm sure that's the state that people are in in Europe and all over the world. And then it says, next, without self-control, brutal, not loving good. So what it's meaning when it says not loving good, we're not loving the truth of God's word. We're not loving the truth of what God stands for. And then what it says after that, treacherous, reckless, swollen with conceit, lovers of pleasure rather than lovers of God. So we're lovers of everything else, but we're anti-God. We're, um, we don't love God, but we love everything else. Sounds, And then it says after that, Having the appearance of godliness. That is 100% America. We have the appearance of godliness. We have the appearance that we're saved Christians. But we deny the power of. We we um, look like we're saved. We look like we're Christians. We do all these rituals. But they're false. They aren't true to what God's word says. We need to follow God's word. And we need to... Be true to what God's word says. And it says, avoid such people.